Hello, I'm Ahmad Nasr. I'm an LLM and TFS consultant. Today, we're going to talk about introduction to platform testing with Microsoft Test Manager 2012. This lab will introduce you to working with platform testing configurations in Microsoft Test Manager. Learn how to use Microsoft Test Manager to create new test configurations and assign them to a test plan and how to assign test configurations to existing test cases. You will also learn how to assign test cases to different testers based on test configurations. Prerequisites You will need to have Visual Studio 2012 virtual machine that's provided by Microsoft. Also, this lab is one of, out of a number of labs that deal with Microsoft Test Manager. The recommended order to complete the labs in is as follows. Introduction to Test Planning with Microsoft Test Manager Introduction to Test Case Management with Microsoft Test Manager Authoring and running manual tests using Microsoft Test Manager and our lab introduction to platform testing with Microsoft Test Manager. There are, we have here four exercises. The first is creating new test configuration for test plans. Second, assigning test configurations to existing test cases. Third, assigning test cases to tester based on co test configurations. And fourth, filtering tests and viewing test configuration when analyzing test runs. Exercise one, creating new test configurations for test plans. In this exercise, you will learn how to use Microsoft Test Manager to create new test configurations and assign them to a test plan. So now we'll begin. I will now enter with uh, Julia and write the password, which is B capital two S S W U R D. We will now open Microsoft Test Manager. Microsoft Test Manager by default open with the most recently loaded test plan which is in this case will be iteration 2. We'll now select the organize tab and then select test configurations manager. We will make now a new test configuration I'm going to write here in Server 2008 and Firefox 3. Now I will add the configuration variables. I will choose the operating system to be on the Server 2008 and the browser to be Firefox 3. Now I'm going to save it. Now as you can see, our new test configuration has been added to the test configuration manager. I will now go to the plan and click on properties to change the properties of iteration 2. In the properties we can find the configuration part here for this plan. I will now gonna change it to also include the new test configuration we have made. Choose Windows Server and Firefox and click on apply. Now I'm going to click on save and close and by this we have ended exercise 1 with exercise 2 which is assigning test configurations to existing test cases we learn how to assign test configuration to existing test cases I will now choose one of test cases to change its configuration now if you see at the right there is a configuration part which we will now change it to include our new test configuration Windows 2008 and Firefox 3. Now close and now click on the test tab and so as you can see here a new instance of this test case has been added for the configuration of 2008 server and Firefox 3. And now we have successfully assigned a configuration to existing test cases. And this is the end of exercise 2. With exercise 3, assigning test cases to a tester based on test configuration. You will learn here how to assign test cases to different testers based on test configurations. Let's begin. I will now click on the plan tab. I will now choose the two test cases we have here and click on assign 
In Assign Testers window, test cases are shown with all assigned configurations. Note that each test case and configuration combination can be assigned to a different tester. So I will now select the one with the configuration Windows Server 2008 and Firefox 3 and change it from Adam to Julia. Now going to save it. Now, as you can see here, the first test case has multiple testers, which means we have more than one tester for different test configuration for this test case. And now this is the end of exercise 3. Exercise 4, filtering tests and viewing test configuration when analyzing test runs. In this, you will learn how to filter running tests and view test configuration when analyzing test runs. Let's begin. And now we'll click on the test tab. In test tab, you need to be sure that you have selected the run tests. I will now gonna set a filter. I will choose Windows Server 2008 and TXPro 8. Set the filter. Now, as you can see, it only gets me the test cases with the configurations Windows Server 2008 and TXPro 8. I will now gonna view the results of this test case. And as you can see here, it tells us its configuration is based on Windows Server 2008 and TXPlorer 8. I will now gonna click on Analyze Test Runs. I will gonna now select one of the test runs here to see its details. I will choose the one that was filled status. As you can see here, this is the details of this test run. I will click on the tests. It tells me here that it has been filled twice, one for the configuration Windows 2008 and the other one for Windows 7. This is the end of exercise 4. I hope you have enjoyed this lab. Thank you.